Hi, my name's Bob Lindy. I'm an herbalist and an herb grower. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to maintain your indoor herb garden. So, probably the single most important thing to do if you've got an indoor herb garden is to make sure that it gets enough light. So usually we want to go and find a good southern or western exposure window and ensure that it gets good light. Probably one of the biggest mistakes that people make maintaining their garden is actually overwatering their herbs. Many of our culinary herbs that we use are actually coming from a place that's fairly dry. So you can go ahead and make sure that your soil is just ever so moist, but never sopping wet. So make sure your soil is well drained. And of course, it's actually beneficial to keep trimming your herbs back. So making sure that you constantly trim those herbs every two weeks or so because otherwise it can either go into flower, in which case you start to lose some of that wonderful taste and smell, or even some of the ones like rosemary, for instance. We want to keep trimming it back so it gets bushier and ever so flavorful with the newer leaves and the shoots that come off of it. So make sure that you actually trim your herbs and utilize them in your cooking on a regular basis. Water it, but don't overwater it, and make sure that your plants get enough light. One trick is actually to bring your, your potted plants uh, outside for some natural light on a regular basis if you are having a problem with finding a good window with southern or western exposure. So if your pot's small enough to carry out, you can just bring it out for a little while out into your driveway or somewhere outdoors where it gets some natural light. And then just bring it back again when you get back from work or after you feel like it's gotten a couple of hours of good sunlight. This is Bob Lindy talking to you about how to maintain your indoor herb garden.